College Hoops on 2K Sports. The Michigan Wolverines take on the Purdue Boilermakers. Welcome aboard, everyone. The Wolverines control the tip-off, and we'll get this one started. the first. Good on number two. And he nails the third. Number 51 inbounds the ball. Price. Stanley throws it up. Number 50 pulls it in. Now let's check in with the third member of our team, Tracy Wilson. Tracy? Thanks, guys. Earlier on, I caught up with Coach Painter. He told me that they want to use their quickness to their advantage. He said they couldn't think of another squad that could match their team speed, and he wants to make sure that shows tonight by getting out on the break and showing how fast this game can be played. Guys? Thanks, Tracy. Dishes to the wing. Only a few seconds left in the shot clock. Launches one from beyond the arc. Pulled in by Reed. There you go. Clean up after the rebound and make sure there isn't another one. Some outstanding physical play out there tonight. Brown. Nice little crossover. Down the first one. He's off on the second. Catches it. High post. Reed. Takes it up, slides in with a soft finger roll. They lead six to one. Stanley skips it to the right, backs down, takes it up. It's good! We've got a full house today, and this crowd is ecstatic. They're now behind by three. Top of the key. Number two. Number 15 has it. Right wing. Stanley gets the reach in call, and that's his first foul of the game. If you're going to go for the steal like that, you've got to be careful with your hands. Reed inbounds the ball. Number 15. Number two bounces it to the left. Perimeter. Number 25. The last shot missed from three-point range. Michigan creates all sorts of problems with their defense. They play passing lanes well and always find a way to force tough shots. These guys are having trouble with fundamental team play, Vern. As that turnover shows you, they don't have much in the way of chemistry at the moment.
Number two gets it. Left wing. Skip pass to the paint. Last shot laid in by Nixon. What a job taking it to the 10 against the big fella. Great finish. Brown. Zero. Beats it to the wing. Stanley. Good. They narrow the gap to two. There's no question what kind of defense they're in, Vern. Miniman. Outright. Nixon backs him down. Dishes it to the elbow. Reed. Number 25 from 20 feet out. Right in the bottom of the bucket. He's got four. Skips it to the baseline. Poked away. And it's scooped up by Nixon. It's one on one. Goes up. Stop home by number 50. And they're out in front by six. Brown gets it. Left wing. Zero. From deep, Reed snatches it down inside. Oh, the big fella with a tough rebound. No denying him on that one. No good on the last layup by number two. Zero passes cross court. Corner. Stanley takes it up. Not this time. Number two has picked up his first foul of the game. And he makes the first. Both teams are making a few lineup changes. Splits the free throws. Dishes to the low block. And the ball will land out of bounds after the errant shot. Cobb makes his first appearance. Zero inbounds the ball. Under 15 minutes left in the half. Stanley swings it to the left wing. Passes right wing. Zero. Number 50 corrals the miss inside. The D wasn't too worried about that one. Gave him room to get it off. Mainly because they prefer the long three over him driving it in. Down the first one. He gets the second to fall as well. Price inbounds the ball. Michigan really knows how to put the ball in the basket. They have a great offensive mindset and can put points up in a hurry. Catches it on the low block. Fires from 11 feet out. That one was drilled by Zero. But they're still down by five. Nixon beats it to the top of the key. Cobb gets called for the reach, and that will be his second foul of the game. Number 32 to make his first stand off the bench. Left wing. 
Passes it to the low block. Stolen by Purdue. Leads him with the pass. Stanley goes up. Finishes the break. And they're now behind by three. Reed. Dishes to the right wing. Behind the arc. The shot was knocked down by Wright. They take a six-point lead. Stanley brings it up the floor. Picked off by Nixon. That's his second steal of the contest. Oh, the quick hands. Before they even knew what hit them. He made off with that one. the first. Both teams are making substitutions. He's off on the second. Number 25 goes up. Price snatches the rebound. They still have a seven-point lead. Brown. It's picked off by Nixon. Listen to the crowd burn. This kind of excitement is why I love college basketball. Has it. Top of the key. Beats it to the wing. Number two. Number 25, catches it, left side. Price went after that rebound hard. Great work. Dumps it down low. Nice move. Laid in by Price. They narrow it to five. Brown takes it up. He gets hammered, and he'll head to the strike. Down the first one. And he'll come away one of two. Gaines did get that rebound by accident. He knew right where to be. Off target on the last layup. About 11 and a half minutes left in the half. Pulling down the rebound. Off the deck. Number 32. Lays it right in. He's got two. Gets it, right side. Low block, takes it in. Grabbed by Brown. But they're still out in front by four. Dishes it to the free throw line. Knocked loose, but it's recovered by Price. Number 41, takes it up. Pretty pass by Price. But they're still behind by two. Both teams are going to shake things up a little bit with some subs. Brown inbounds the ball. Steptoe is tagged with the reach. They're in the bonus here, so that'll be a one and one at the line. Important foul. They're in the penalty now. Comes up empty on the front end of the one and one. Number 32 passes it up court. Number 51.
skips it to the baseline. Number 51 grabs the offensive rebound. Finished nicely down low on that last shot. That's how to finish the hoop burn. Take it up strong. Bounce pass, baseline. Number two. Catches it, right wing. Tipped, and it's out of bounds. Last touch by Michigan. Number 32, inbounds the ball. Step to, bounces it to the right side. Number 15. Beautiful work to fight through that foul and get to the line for the three opportunity. Can't convert the three-point play. Just over nine minutes left in the half. Passes to the wing. Number 51 gets it on the free throw line. Dishes, baseline. No one around him. Might have rushed that one just a little bit. There was plenty of time on the shot clock, but he got a little over anxious. Brown. Has it down low. Number two puts it up. Can't connect from long range. Still a two-point lead. Steptoe feeds it to the left wing. To the free throw line. Dumps it down low. Brown to give them the lead. Throws it up. That offensive rebound didn't come to him by accident. He knew right where to be. And we're now all tied up 21. Brown hands it off. Pass out left. Number 25. Oh, net in the shot by Brown. And they now go up by two. Well, let's get back to the action. The Michigan coach may have to deal with some chemistry issues after those substitutions because that gives them a pretty inexperienced lineup out there. Catches it. Down low. Picks it. They rule this one goaltending. Count the shot. Zero inbounds the ball. Zero crosses it over. Outside. Passes it to the right wing. Zero dumps it off. Number two. Pulls the trigger. Grabbed inside by Dixon. The Boilermakers looking for their first lead of the game. He got it up there, but it just wouldn't fall. With a little more touch, it might have. Number 32 goes up, gets the go-ahead bucket. They're ahead, 25 to 23. With the floater, laid up and in by Reed. We've now got a tie ball game. They're playing man-to-man -man here, Vern. Brown gets it outright. What a beauty of a shot. <laughs> a great display of his mid-range game. Number two.
Catches it in the paint. It was nailed by Wright. And it's all tied up. Right around six minutes left in the half. Steptoe dishes it to the wing. To the free throw line. Passes to the right. Brown takes the three. Wright has it. And that's his third rebound of the contest. When a shot like that comes around, you've got to hit it. They just dared him to shoot. Zero. Beats it to the high post. Shoots from the top of the key. Snatched by number 51. He just didn't look comfortable on that shot, Fern, and you can see it in the result. Brown catches it down low. His eyes lit up when he saw that shot go up. I love when guys get that excited about defense. The crossover, number 50, takes it up, gets the go-ahead bucket. And they lead by two. Under five minutes left in the half. Far side. Skips it to the right corner. Brown. Beyond the arc. It was hit by Steptoe. They now lead by one. Zero inbounds the ball. Well, it looks like they're getting set to inbound the ball. Substitution. Gain has it, right side. Under four minutes left in the half, leads him in. Stepta fouled hard, and he'll take a trip to the line. Shooting two. the first he gets them both Reed inbounds the ball zero Zero goes to the crossover. Reed, the 15-footer. Dixon snags it. About three and a half minutes left in the half. Wow, his mid-range game is generally solid. He can't believe it, and I can't believe it. Gets it on the free throw line with the shot. The little leaner was hit by Dixon. They got on this roll a while ago and just haven't looked back. Wow, these fans are going nuts, Fern. Could this building get any louder? Backs in. Two fifty-seven left in the first half. Left wing passes it to the left wing, sizing up his man. He needs to make sure he gets a piece of the ball too. If he's going to foul him that late on an attempt. Shot is good for a three-point play. It looks like they're playing minimum. Well, it looks like they're getting set to inbound the ball. Reed inbounds the ball. Leads him with the pass. 
Purdue has had serious problems with their interior defense. And Tracy has a report from their bench. Coach Painter is definitely aware of that problem. He told his assistants that they have to bring more defenders into the paint, even if it means leaving the perimeter open. Desperate measures here, Vern. Thanks, Tracy. Reed. Game goes up. Hits the layup after the pump fake freezes the D. They now trail by four. Two minutes left in the first half. Price catches it, top of the key. Step toe. It takes a bad bounce and goes out of bounds. Both teams will make some substitutions. Number 15 inbounds the ball. Gets it, right wing. The Wolverines turn this one over, out of bounds. One twenty-two left in the first half. Stanley dishes to the right wing. To the stripe. Shoots. The 18-footer on the money by Stanley. He's got 11. Reed. Bounces it down low. them both. Dixon inbounds the ball. The Boilermakers could get two for one if they hurry. Shooting two. Knocks down the first one. Right is back in the game after a short rest. He's off on the second. Seven second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. Right. Has it. Right wing. Dumps it inside. Brown is whistled for reaching in. They're in the double bonus, and they'll go to the line for two. He should concentrate on just getting good position instead of flailing away at the ball like that. He can't get the first. He's going to come away empty from the line. Nixon. Three. And it's picked up by Purdue. I'd love to see that. He was lurking around then pounce. Such a deep break. First half comes to an end with the score 42 to 35. How about the happenings in the first half, Bill? I can't think of too much good to say about this game, so Bert, maybe you can do play by play and color. We're all set to begin the second half. Hmm. 
Price inbounds it to start the second half. Catches it. High post. Brown from 18 feet away. He rips down the rebound. Leads him with the pass. Nixon. Nice work by the big fella to get that rebound. He's shooting 50% for the game. The steal. The D was really waiting for him there. That's how you do it. Keep the heat on. Wait for the misstep and then capitalize. Left wing. There's a whistle. He's got to be worried about the foul situation here. It could really affect his play defensively. Dishes it to the elbow. Number 25. Number 25. The last shot missed from three-point range. And that's a good job to grab that rebound. Perfect position that time. Stanley kicks it out to the wing. Left wing. Skips it to the inside. Brown with the shot. He's off from three. But they're still up by five. Nixon. Number two has it on the inside. Skip pass to the stripe. Number 15. Foul! Number 41 is needed out on the floor. He didn't get much of a rest. Gets the second to fall as well. Price inbounds the ball. You know what kind of defense they're in, don't you, Vern? Minimum. Stanley bounces it down low. The last layup is dropped in by Price. Sweet! He put that bounce pass right in his hip pocket. He has great court sense. High post. Dishes to the wing. Number two. Number 25, from long range, on the money. He's two for six for the game. Stanley catches it down low. Price, a huge blunder on that three-second violation. Number 25, inbounds the ball. Here comes the double team. About 16 and a half minutes left in the second half. Nixon passes it to the top of the key. Left wing. Nixon. One on one. Reed releases. Just missed it. No three-point opportunity, but he'll go to the line for two.
can't sink the first. He sinks the second. Price inbounds the ball. Dishes it to the elbow. Bounce pass, right side. Brown from 18 feet away. It's off. They're still up by one. Nixon. The crossover. He fouls him. You're never going to get away bumping the ball handler on a steal attempt. Too aggressive. Both teams are going to shake things up a little bit with some subs. Michigan wants more experience out on the floor, and they're bringing on the senior. Nixon lobs it to the middle. Perimeter skips it to the corner. Number 15. Nixon shoots. Can't take the lead. Oh, not real good shot selection, Vern. They've got to exercise a little patience and move the ball around. Dumps it inside. Passes like that make it so easy for the shooter. Number 50 inbounds the ball. Right around 15 minutes left in the second half. The crossover fouls in. Nails it. He gets them both. Price has it. High post. Number 41 takes it up. Gently drops it in. And they're now out in front by three. Number two. There's a whistle. Come away one of two. Number 41 hands it off. Catches it. High post. Number 41 swings it to the wing. Beats it to the left wing. Brown. He grabs the rebound. Price pulled down that offensive board like it was no problem. What a battler. The Wolverines can tie it with a basket. Number two. Passes to the top of the key. Number 15 gets it outright. That last shot missed from 13. Brown fought for that rebound. That's some toughness for you. Skip pass, right side. Number 41. Number 32, backs down. He rips down the rebound. Just over 13 minutes left in the second half. I wouldn't bet on him missing that one again. Nixon dishes to the high post. The crossover. Right to tie. 
Davis! They're still down seven. Brown dumps it off. Left side. Passes to the top of the key. Number 32. Brown shoots it up. Can't put an end to the scoring drought. But they still lead by two. Bounces it down low. Me. Nothing but net. And we're all tied up 48. Both teams are going to make some substitutions. Dempsey inbounds the ball. Number 32 gets it right wing. Passes to the free throw line. Stanley raises up, pulls it in. Great offensive rebound. He worked so hard to establish position. One on one. Has it right side. Left wing. Dishes it to the left. Step toe. Tries the spin move. Commits the foul. He's got it to go. Gets the second to fall as well. Wright inbounds the ball. Dane hands it off. It's deflected, but it's retrieved by Gaines. Reed has it inside. Gets whistled for a foul. And it down. He gets the second to fall as well. They're set up in minimum. Swing pass. Left wing. Dempsey gets it. Right wing. Stanley dishes to the right side. Perimeter. Step to from about 19 feet. Grabs the rebound. The Wolverines can take their first lead in a long time with a basket here. The intercept. What great reflexes. He pounced in and picked that one off easily. Stanley puts it up. Brings it for three. He's shooting 66% from downtown. Number two dumps it off. Right. Number two launches it, gets the bucket. He's one for two from deep. Steptoe catches it on the corner. Feeds baseline. Dixon, 14 feet out. No dice. And it's still knotted up 53. Reed. Number 32 inbounds the ball. The crossover. Stanley, it's blocked. Dixon with a great offensive rebound there. He worked so hard to establish position. 
Just over nine minutes left in the second half. The intercept. What great reflexes. He pounced in and picked that one off easily. Catches it. Left wing. Number two. Hands it off. Right. Jacks up a three. He snatches it off the glass. When a D got lucky there, Vern, you can't expect many misses when you're that open. Dixon. This crowd couldn't be any happier. Just listen to the people in this building. Substitution. Number 50 inbounds the ball. Nixon brings it up. Passes it to the right. Pass, right wing. Backs him down. Nixon. Off target. What a good job on the defense to make him think about that shot. Stanley dishes it to the wing. To the stripe. Kicks it out to the left wing. Zero. From way back, he rips down the rebound. About seven and a half minutes left in the second half. You've just got to hit that shot when you've got that much space. Skips it to the left side. Dishes. Baseline. Number 25. Releases. Nails it from the wing. They narrow the gap to two. Zero. Catches it in the corner. Brown. No luck. Still a two-point lead. Right for the tie. Count it. And the foul. Terrific work to absorb the contact, hang in the air, and hit the shot. Pretty, Vern. Nails it. Price inbounds the ball. Stanley passes to the stripe, to the paint. Price, he grabs the rebound. Zero. That offensive rebound didn't come to him by accident. He knew right where to be. Right goes up. Shot's good. And he was fouled. A superior effort to fight through the foul and put it down. Strong move, Vertus. Can't complete the three-point play. Zero. Number 51 gets it. Middle. Michigan still holds a narrow lead. Nixon dumps it off. Number 50 gets it right wing. Right wing passes it back to the right side. Number 50. That's not the smartest shot in the world. They've got to work harder than that for a good look. The crossover. Brown to put an end to the run. About five and a half minutes left in the second half. Right goes up. Count it. They're out in front by five. The Wolverines are putting the rest of their starting lineup back on the floor. Price inbounds the ball.
Brown. Zero bounces it to the free throw line. Out left. Let's it go. Gets the jumper. But they're still behind by three. Nixon brings it up court. Skips it to the high post. Number two. Hands it off. Passes it to the top of the key. Nixon has it. Left wing. Zero inbounds the ball. The Boilermakers will take a timeout. Passes to the elbow. Zero. Price tosses it up. He rips down the rebound. The Wolverines carry it up. They're on an 11 to 2 run. Number 25 beats it to the high post. Left block. Nice speed by number two. They bring their lead to seven. Dishes it to the top of the key. Brown off the mark from the land. Purdue has struggled with their three-point shooting. And Tracy has a report from their bench. Coach Painter wants to see his players move more effectively without the ball so they can get better looks at the basket. He told his guys, if you get to the open spot on the floor, I know you can hit that shot. Vern? All right, Tracy. Reed swings it to the wing. Number two. Has it. High post. Reed passes to the right wing. Number 25. He grabs the rebound. And the last layup is dropped in by Nixon. They're getting set to inbound the ball. Number 51. Inbounds the ball. Number two. Flips it in for two. The streak continues, and that's 17 unanswered. Stanley wasn't watching the line there. That's going to be over and back. Well, things just aren't going their way. Turnovers like that tell a story for how this game is played out. Dishes to the top of the key. Reed dumps it off. Reed gets it down low. Reed getting as hot as he has can do so much for this team's confidence and chemistry. They now have more options on the floor. Zero. Can't put an end to the run. The Wolverines should look to use some clock here. They can't seem to put an end to this run. They need to get their offense going, and soon. Catches it. Right wing. Top of the key. Nixon. Stanley reels it in. Shoots it. Trifecta. And they're now down by 10. The Wolverines have this game pretty much in the bag. Number 15 catches it. High post. 
Pass. Low block. Yanked down by Price. I don't think they can come back. There's too far to climb in too short a time. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Purdue. Number 25 inbounds the ball. 31 seconds left in the game. Number two. Gets it. Left wing. Out right. Passes it to the corner. Number 25. Number two. Hands it off. And that's all for this one. Michigan beats the Boilermakers 74 to 64.